Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're listening, welcome to my podcast. I want to talk about the show that stops our hearts. Yes, Heart Stopper on Netflix is an amazing and the most lovable TV show I've ever seen. And I'm not the only one thinking that because there are a lot of people who say the same thing. And the great news about this show is that Netflix said and announced that Heart Stopper is signed for two more seasons at least okay so our hearts will stop at least two more times okay and what i'm talking about like have you actually seen the show like i know a lot of people say oh netflix is you know it's rubbish and so on and actually it is but there are some shows that are worth it and of course some films as well is it worth for the price increase that they made. I mean, I think so, but you know, there's a lot of rubbish there, but there's a lot of good stuff as well. Um, and if you haven't seen it, I'm telling you, this is the most beautiful high school story I've ever seen. And it's British, that's a bonus. The cast, the performances, everything is amazing. If you watched it, let me know in the comments what you thought about it. And the only reason I watched it, because I wasn't sure, because I don't really I'm not really into series because I don't want to spend too much time on it. But when the first reviews were coming in, I was just looking and I've seen like, this is the most lovable show. There's literally absolutely nothing that you can dislike about this show. It's so innocent and it's so good. It's so well done. You, you cannot hate it. It's, it's impossible. I'm telling you, it's impossible. And I just want to say that, okay, so this was Heartstopper was filmed in Hern Bay in Kent in the UK. And the main characters are Charlie and Nick. Uh, Joe Lockie, I guess, plays Charlie Spring. He's 18 years old in real life. Kit Connor plays Nick Nelson, the handsome one. And he's 18 years old. And oh, he looks actually older. Um, and the other cast members, which are amazing as well, are between 18 and 20 years old, mostly. Um, and Heartstopper has, of course, it was trending on Netflix. And also it has a new record on Twitter, which had 1.3 million engagements in seven days. And that is more than MCU series She-Hulk or Stranger Things. I think that says it all. That says a lot. But anyway... Did I mention that Nick's mom in the story is played by Olivia Colman, the Oscar Academy Award winner? Which is like a bonus, you know. What is the secret to success of this story, of this TV show? Basically, it's honesty. It's a really good script, good cast, and a really important message to share. And I think, especially for younger audience, obviously... Um, and I think, you know, when this all comes together, you have a great show like this. And the first season was just to die for. <laughs> and if you didn't know, this was actually inspired by a comic book or graphic novel. I'm not sure. Uh, Alice Oseman, she wrote Heartstopper book, comic book, yeah, graphic novels. Um, and Netflix was, you know, Netflix decided to make this into a TV show and obviously it was a good idea. Okay, if you want to go back to your teenage years, high school, your first love and your first heartbreak, there's not so much heartbreak. And this is what I like about the show. It's not like, okay, it's not all positive, but it's like mostly positive and it's like, you know this is gonna have a happy ending and yeah i like that this is not like a drama and you know love like everything goes wrong and it's just drama 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 like a telenovela like this is literally so good chilled relaxed nice lovely and it's just yeah i'm sorry for the spoilers it's just it has happy end because we want it. Everybody wants it. Okay, 
let me know what you thought about this if you watched it and if you haven't watched it honestly go go watch it it's so nice and subscribe did i make your heart stop as well let me know